Hi guys, welcome back to another video of Jerry's Tech Corner where I help tech work for you. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to convert your YouTube channel to a, a mobile Android application where your subscribers can download the app to their phone. So the advantage of creating this app is that so users do not need to go to YouTube to search for your channel and so they can just download this app and they can install the app and they can watch the videos from the app itself so before getting started be sure to hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my channel as my channel is all talking about technology and reviews so let's get started okay so the website we are using is a website called apps Gazer. so in google you're just going to type apps Gazer and you click the first link and you will end up in this page in the dashboard. You will need to create a Google, uh, you need to create an account in Apps Gazer in order to create apps. So coming to the page, uh, you don't need to do anything here. Just gonna hate to create app. And over here, as you can see, they got two different types: business, individual. Individual apps is where you can create other types of apps like photo editors guides website browsers chat but for today uh we're gonna head to business and over here as you can see youtube turn youtube channel into playlist or app so you're just gonna click here and so now uh i'm gonna open up my youtube channel this is my youtube channel uh jerry's tech corner and uh be, be sure to have actually have content in your youtube channel Otherwise, the no content will be able to show in your application. So make sure you have uh, lots of content like mine. If you haven't watched some of my other videos, you can make, go and watch. So over here in the apps case, what I like about this is that you don't need any coding. There's no coding required. All you just need to do is to just to fill in text, uh, put your channel ID, and just click next and over here you that's a android is a virtual phone to see the preview so let's just click next okay so this is the part where lots of people end up being confused uh so so over here you need to enter your youtube api key uh and then enter the channel url or your channel name so first of all uh let's enter the channel name first so i'm gonna go to my very tech corner channel yeah just going to click into my youtube go back here and yeah i'm just gonna paste here right so this is our youtube channel link uh, the url state channel to playlist uh no all right so enter youtube api key so api key is different than your channel id if you don't know what don't if you do not know what channel id is channel id is a special id given by youtube uh for, specifically for your channel but the api key is different so what you're gonna need to do, you need to head into a uh, Google Cloud, Google Cloud Console. Oh, once you head to cloud.google.com, you're gonna search. You're gonna click Console, and it will lead me to my uh Google pla cloud platform console. Make sure you have a Google account as well. So uh over here, what you're gonna do now? You're gonna cl click over here you're going to click new project you're going to give a project name example my youtube channel app uh, you don't need to fill in this just going to click create right so uh, as you can see here it's creating let's just wait until it's create okay so you're going to select the project select project you're gonna do now it's gonna head into the navigation menu here. As you can see here, API and service. You're gonna to go to library. 
and over in the library what you're going to do is you're going to search for youtube api version 3 the first one over here you can click it and you're gonna click enable give you a moment to enable it okay so it's already been enabled and you will then come into this picture here uh you don't need to do anything uh you need to care about in this graph you're going to just go create create credentials okay, and i'm in the credentials tab and you're going to choose what api you're using so we're going to you can click youtube data api entry what platform android it's a public data you can click what credentials do i need and over here, there it is. This is my API key over here. And you're going to click copy. It. So it's already copied. And you're going to control V to paste the API key over here. And so over here, we can click to see the preview. And there you go. This is my YouTube channel app. As you can see here, this um my videos. It's now showing up here, so yeah, it's working. After here, uh, you can also choose the appearance settings. You can change the color. I'm gonna change my color to my color channel, which is purple. Okay. Click next. If your app name, just gonna put JTC YouTube channel channel. Uh, so you're going to refresh the preview. You can see here, JTC YouTube channel. So uh, it's done, app name. Okay, next. Now what you're going to do, you can choose the app icon. So I'm just going to click custom icon. And I'm going to find uh, my icon that I want. This is my channel icon. Uh, I'm just going to crop next and click create and so now as you can see here up here jtc youtube channel what you're going to do is you're going to download the apk and so now you can finally download the apk file onto your android device now you might be wondering if you can actually publish this to the google play store uh, Yes, you can, but you will need to create a Google Play console account, which will cost you 25 US dollars. Currently, I do not have an, a Google Play console account. So uh, you got the limitation of actually get, getting people to install your apps. It's better if you're in the Google Play store so you can distribute your apps worldwide, but through APK link, it's going to be limited. And so you can also send your app through the email, send a link here, or you can download as an AAB app bundle file. Android package, and you can scan the QR code to download it. So if you want to download it, feel free to scan this QR code to download it, or I will leave this link in the description. Next, I will show you how the app looks like in the mobile device. App on my phone, so it is showing up here, Jerry's Tech Corner app. Just gonna click into the app. And now let's give you a moment to load the app. So you can see here, Jerry Set Corner YouTube channel. I've actually modified the name a bit. I, I decided to put the full name. Over here, then you'll show uh, my videos, the title of my videos, the description of the videos. So it's really cool that it's showing up all my view, the videos here. Over here, I've actually uh, viewed some of the videos. So the app can also tell me that view the videos that I've already watched before. Uh, I've already I actually test test out this app and it's actually really quite great. The quality is great. O over here, I can uh, viewers can click to show notifications about new videos, uh, as well. So for example, uh, I click one of my latest video. Let's give it a moment to load, and you can see. It's currently playing my Hi everyone. latest video. I minimize the screen. I can even maximize it. So I click 
the next over here it allows me to share the video and right here there's a star which can save the, vi the video that of your favorites as well it show me the likes the dislikes it show me the channel description over here and over here it show me similar videos so it's really very nice there are a lot of details in the app so it, there's no coding required and you are able to build such a, a beautiful app for your youtube channel so this is how you're going to convert your youtube channel into a mobile android application for your viewers out there to use so i do hope you have found this video interesting if you do please hit the thumbs up button drop down a comment to find out what video should i do next and do remember to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next video bye